Hey, what's going on YouTube? This is Lone Fox 4737 and I don't usually do these videos, but this is a tutorial. Uh, it came and helped for me a lot. Uh, I didn't, I can find anything like this on a forum or a YouTube video itself. I've actually been looking around and forever because this one problem that we get here. But uh, if you have a Aver Media Live Gamer portable and you want to use OBS, you need to have this program called LGB Stream Engine. And it basically, you know, sends the video to a video source or a video device, a fake one, or whatever, just to make it work with most, oh, all streaming programs besides only working with XSplit Broadcaster. Now, I, on the forums, have heard that it's because of Skype, but it's not because of Skype at all. I actually just have it closed. Uh, it could be because of Skype, but usually it's not. Um, I've had Skype open and used xsplit at the same time works or not xsplit uh obs at the same time uh it works perfectly fine i'll prove it to you after i show you this now everyone's been saying it's skype right but it's that's wrong it's totally wrong now i actually already did it i just i was just recording a live com or a live whatever this i was recording this live about two minutes ago and then i figured out that i could do something to make it work without having to go through whatever. So before I go any farther, I'll just say that it is Google Chrome. When Google Chrome is open, Stream Engine will not work. You go LGP properties, look okay, at nothing. All right, now we go close window, properties, LGP uh, Stream Engine. Look at that. Um, so, yeah, so before I go and show you Skype, actually what I did is, I don't know how to make it come back, but I don't know if it pops up on Windows 7, but I know it did for Windows 8 for sure, is there was a little Google Chrome icon, even when this was, like, oh, when this was open, there's a Chrome icon, you right click on it and you say, there's a check mark beside let run in background, let it run in the background or whatever. And so I was like, oh, because before what you had to do, I was doing is I went to uh, the uh, task manager and I deleted, I end, ended all this Google Chrome task, whatever stuff. And there was, there's a lot. And that took, takes a little, quite a while, just saying, but that worked a lot better. I don't know if I can re-enable it, but uh, I just right-clicked and unchecked that Chrome run in the background. And then it also frees up some of your memory space because Google Chrome is a power-hungry beast. It is. Um, so I don't know if you are using a different browser and it's still not working, then try just ending the task of the other pro uh, browser, uh, browsers. But what I did find out is how I found that out. With Google Chrome, that was Google Chrome, not Skype. Well, actually, I'll show you. It's not Skype. Yeah, let's run Skype. <laughs> Minus out of that, you go uh, ch -ch -ch -ch, Open Broadcaster. You go LGP Properties. And Stream Engine's still there, so it's not Skype. Uh, but the way I found out it was Chrome was when I was uninstalling I was trying to reinstall and un uninstall stuff till it worked. When I was uninstalling the stream engine, it said that it couldn't get rid of a certain program or a certain folder. I'll actually open up the folder. Uh, it was this folder right here. Now, see, if you go here, if you open up Chrome and you press delete, continue, cannot be, this cannot be completed because the folder files open in another program. Then you go here, and it was, I don't remember which one it was. It was one of these, I think it's this one. You go continue. This action cannot be completed because the file is open in Google Chrome. If I exited out of this, I could delete all these now. But before, when you're reinstalling something, if you guys have done this, it'd say that uh, it couldn't install a certain file because it's already there. And you had to press like, uh, abort, ignore, or cancel, something like that. Yeah, it's because that file's open in Google Chrome. So yeah, uh, that's the end of the video. 
If that helps you out, don't forget to leave a like, share this around, and everything like that. And I'll see you guys later. Oh, yeah, and don't forget to follow me on Twitch. Uh, it's the Lone Fox 4737 The link is in the description below. I try to stream daily, if not uh, every couple days. And I also do YouTube videos and stuff. So uh, thanks for watching, and see you guys later.